fun. You know, fun basically hanging out. Um, this past this past time, I'm trying to go do I'll do a lot of fishing. Um, basically, I'm just into doing video editing and, and trying to make a story out of nothing. Are or, you actually working on something? Um, I got a lot. I got to see some. Kind I, got, of I, 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 I got some stuff. I got some <laughs> stuff on the deal. It's just just gotta just gotta get the time to find to do it. You know. Yeah. Um, Basically, just hanging out with the family, doing you know, having get-togethers and just getting back home. Yeah. That's the hard part. When I'm in California, I just constantly think I want to get back home mm -hmm. and get get what get my job done and go home. That's the main thing. Because when I'm home, it's too a little bit more. I like I guess I like to live in stress or something because when you go home, you have to deal with the kids and the deal with this or run here and do that. I guess I like that. I just I miss that. Right. Um, future. What what can we expect from you in the future? In the future, I'm always going to be in the sport. Mm -hmm. I mean, I. I probably have probably three, four more years left in the sport fighting. If and it's all about training right instead of training wrong. I don't want to push too hard. You know, I have no major injuries and I have no you know broken knees or mm -hmm. you know any big things that are going to slow me down. I just got to fight the right fights and train right for them. Um, I'm always going to be in the sport. You know, I'm trying to do I'm trying to build a spinoff, commentating, maybe even help other fighters, seminars. You know, there's just I love the sport so much. I want to get something back, and that's all about leaving a legacy. Mm -hmm. So. Um, I heard that you might be interested in fighting Kimbo Slice. Is that still how's that? You know, it, out? that that was just a, uh, a good friend of mine named uh, Jason, which is Golden Boy on the on the MMA forums, and you know, as this guy comes in, you know, you could say, you know, he just has a lot of wave on, him, a lot of a lot of a lot of push behind him. And he's just so great of a fighter, and, mm -hmm. and all I want to do is just see, oh, let's see how good he is. You know, he's yeah. getting all this hype, and then it turns out the fans don't want it to happen because I have too much too much experience and blah 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 and it kind of died out you know Kimball would be a good fight then it could be a dangerous fight mm -hmm. um, I mean he's, he's trying to learn he's trying to train he's get getting stuff done gotta give him the respect that he is trying to trying to learn the sport but maybe one day maybe not I don't know I mean it's so it's so pushed out there and so far I, I don't think we'll ever meet Maybe we'll meet at a bar and hang out, but I don't think we'll ever meet again. Oh, you buy him a drink? Yeah. Oh, don't know. He's making more than me. I don't know. He'll probably have to buy me a drink. He needs to buy you. <laughs> exactly. Um, so, is there anything that your fans don't know about you or anything that you want to tell your fans? And you know, I'm always approachable. Mm -hmm. No matter what I'm doing, don't ever hesitate. I, I, would, I, would stop in a, stop. I would stop and give you gas or give you a ride. I mean, I'm just. What I do in the cage is, is the only thing that separates me from being human. But I'm. It doesn't. I don't take that action outside the cage. I'm not a. I'm not a prick. I'm, I'm pretty pretty sociable, and I just know how it is. I, I don't. Just because I, I fight good in the cage doesn't mean I have to bring that attitude outside the cage. And you can ask anybody that's always been around me. I'm always just laid back. I'm just a normal person. Everybody's like, I, I can't believe you're a fighter. Okay. Not me neither. But that's just what I do. Nice. Well, there you have it. Paul, right here, the headhunter. <laughs> Thanks so much for talking with us, and for more information about Knox, go to knoxgear.com.